Hey everyone, Jordan here with 9to5toys. If you're spending more time at home these days, which most of us are, then you might be thinking about ways you can clean it up a little bit. One way to help with dust, odors, and overall air quality is to use an air purifier like this OKSAO Air Max 8L. With a relatively clean overall design, easy to use buttons and functions, the Air Max 8L is a great option priced at $118. Let's check it out. Thanks for watching 9to5toys. Be sure to like, subscribe, and enable notifications with the bell icon so you don't miss any upcoming videos. The Air Max 8L is designed to be used in rooms up to 800 square feet, or at least that's the biggest size that they give any sort of spec for. In an 800 square foot room, the Air Max 8L will circulate air 1.5 times per hour. In a 500 square foot, it will circulate three times per hour, and in a 320 square foot room, it'll circulate five times per hour. The Air Max 8L uses two different filters that have a total of five different elements to help purify air. It'll help clean up your air from things like pet odor and dander and dust, but it also helps to remove some harmful gases like formaldehyde and ammonia. Before you use the Air Max 8L for the first time, you do need to remove the filters and take off the packaging that is surrounding them. And that's really easy to do. On the back side of the air purifier, we can remove the door just by pulling it out and it has a magnetic closure and pull up the door to remove it. And that exposes the filters. So we have the first filter, which they call the ultra filter, which has three different elements. And behind that, they have the duo filter that has two different elements to it. And when they first arrive, these both have plastic coverings over them that you do need to remove before you use the filter. So they're really easy to remove and replace. And to reinstall, just put it back in there. Make sure that this tab is visible so you know that it's the right way. And it's at the top there. I'll put the duo filter back in. Everything seems to have a pretty secure fit in there. Then to put the door, it has a magnet here at the top. So you just slide the feet back in the bottom and the top connects back like that. So very easy to open up and change the filters. Overall, the design of the Air Max 8L is uh, pretty clean and very pleasing. It has a modern black and white color scheme to it. The only thing that I find uh, unfortunate about the design is the um, large logo right in the middle of the otherwise very clean design. I mean, obviously you want people to know your brand and promote your brand, but um, that could be done a little bit cleaner. Uh, you know, if the logo was up here at the top or you know down here at the bottom, like you could still have it the same size, but right there in the middle, it's uh, pretty obtrusive for an otherwise, you know, relatively clean design. Otherwise, the Air Max 8L measures in at 13 by seven and a quarter by 20 and a quarter inches. The air inlet is in the back. Um, you can see when we turned it around to remove the cover. So you do need to make sure that it's not right up against the wall. You need a little bit of space in between a wall and the air purifier to make sure that the airflow can circulate through there. On top of the air purifier, we have buttons for speed, a child lock, a power button, sleep button, and a timer. Most of these are pretty self-explanatory, but the child lock button uh, needs to be held down for three seconds to activate it. And that just makes sure that no other buttons can be tampered with if you have children who like to push buttons like my two-year-old does. And then to turn that off again, just press and hold the child lock button for three seconds one more time. And to make the Air Max 8L a little bit nicer at night, the sleep button, it sets the air purifier fan speed in the lowest setting, so it's quietest setting, and then also turns off all the lights on the top so it's not disruptive in a dark room. The other air purifier that I reviewed recently, the Kowei Air Mega Smart Air Purifier, um, auto detects contaminants and adjusts its speed automatically based on what you know what kind of filtration that it's needing to do on the lowest fan speed for the co-way it's almost you know dead silent you can barely hear it i even had it running right next to my microphone while i was recording the video and then on the loudest setting you know it sounds like a jet's about to take off it can get really loud like it's really doing some work obviously with the air max 8l it is not automatic it doesn't automatically detect contaminants and adjust itself um, so in the lowest setting it is doing a little bit more work than what i think the co-way is and because of that, it is more audible. It sounds like a fan kind of set on like a low setting. That's something that I really liked about the Kowei Air Mega is that, you know, you, you can leave it on in the background in the lowest setting when in automatic, um, you can't even tell that it's on, it's really quiet. And then when it starts to speed up, you can tell that it's, you know, detected something and is doing a little bit more work. But with the OK Sao, it's pretty much always audible, always on. And so that just depends on your environment, whether that's a good or a bad thing, that this is always at least a little bit audible. One of the ways I thought I would test the Air Max 8L is by trying to eliminate some pet odor. 
we have a cat and when we clean his cat box, you know, it can smell pretty bad. So I decided to turn it on nearby his cat box while I was changing that to see, you know, what sort of uh, elimination it would do of the litter box odor. And with it set up and turned on close to the litter box, I mean, it didn't eliminate the odor completely immediately. I, I could still smell it while I was changing it, but it definitely did help to dissipate the odor uh, afterwards, you know, usually the odor lingers for a while. Uh, we can smell it is pretty close to the kitchen, so we could kind of smell it in the kitchen sometimes. But having this running nearby definitely helped to dissipate the odor so it wasn't nearly as noticeable as it is without running an air purifier like this. Like we mentioned, it has the two filters and they're very easy to replace and uh, they say the expected life of those is about eight months and that's going to vary depending on you know what kind of contaminants or you know, how much work it's doing throughout the day to clean up a space so there's a light at the top that will turn on when the filter needs to be replaced and you can order those either on ok Sal's website or on amazon and i think both of the filters each run about 19 dollars. so you're looking about 38 dollars to replace both of the filters when that time comes so overall, the Air Max 8L seems like it does a good job of cleaning up odors and improving air quality in a space. It's not as quiet as the Koei Air Mega, but it's also not as loud in its highest setting. It's super easy to use and has a pretty long filter life at eight months. And it also comes with a five-year warranty and US-based support if you have any issues with it. So what do you think of the OK Sal Air Max 8L? Let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. This is Jordan with 9to5toys.